Hi guys welcome to Jamaican Facts. Today we are going to drive on the North-South Highway in Jamaica. Traveling via the Jamaica North-South Highway, JNSH, is a stress-free way to travel. It is a four-lane controlled access tolled motorway with fully graded separated interchanges and intersections built according to modern international standards. The highway connects the capital Kingston to the town of Ocho Rios, passing through St. Catherine. The start of the highway is near the Cayman Oz Economic Zone which connects with the Mandela Highway. The north-south toll road passes through Spanish Town, Bog Walk, Linstead, Wharton, Munig, Golden Grove, and Ocho Rios, terminating Mammy Bay, which is east of St. Anne's Bay and west of Ocho Rios. The JNSH consists of three, three, sections. Section 1 Cayman Oz, Kingston to Linstead, St. Catherine. Section 2 Linstead, St. Catherine to Munig. St. Anne Section 3 Munig to Mammy Bay, St. Anne the North-South Highway is a part of the Highway 2000 project. It gets the name North-South Highway because it is the north-south leg of Highway 2000. Highway 2000 is a highway in Jamaica connecting Kingston, with Montego Bay and Ocho Rios. Passing through the parishes of St. Catherine, St. Anne, Clarendon, and proposed sections through St. James, St. Elizabeth, Westmoreland, Hanover. Toll plazas you can also join or exit the JNSH through any of the six toll plazas along the route, Cayman Oz Toll Plaza, Angels Toll Plaza, Linstead Toll Plaza, Unity Valley Toll Plaza, Lidford Toll Plaza, Mammy Bay Toll Plaza. The highway was built on a phased basis. Phase 2A is considered as the north-south leg, T3. The highway construction project was initialized by Government of Jamaica, former Prime Minister P.J. Patterson, in September 1999. The main objective of this project was to upgrade Jamaica's infrastructure, provide economic opportunities for growth and create jobs. The project is a public-private partnership structured to maximize operational efficiency and minimize costs. The project is still ongoing, with the direct link to Montego Bay yet to be determined. Notably, the intention of connecting Jamaica via such a comprehensive highway system was first expressed and clearly defined in the Jamaican Transportation Survey of 1968-69, as a matter of fact, much of the current Highway 2000 alignments were proposed and defined therein, Phase 2, North-South Leg as well as a proposal to connect the East-West Leg to Montego Bay. The proposed highway system was also included and adopted in the National Physical Plan for Jamaica 1970-90 with suggestions to have an alternate north-south leg from May Penn to Discovery Bay as opposed to the one actually constructed, at present, from Caymanas to Ocho Rios. The NPP was a non-partisan plan for Jamaica, first conducted under the United Nations Special Fund Project Assistance in Physical Planning. The plan was drafted by the then Town Planning Department, now NEPA, of the Ministry of Finance and Planning, Jamaica, and vetted by the then Prime Minister of Jamaica, the Most Honorable Hugh Lawson Shearer on OJPC, as well as the Minister of Finance and Planning, the Most Honorable Edward Philip George Sega on PC. The 66 km Highway 2000 North-South Leg has reduced travel time from Kingston to the north coast town of Ocho Rios and the city of Montego Bay significantly. The construction took take place in three phases, one Mount Rosser Bypass, 19.3 km, completed August 5, 2014 to Cayman Oz to Linstead, May 2013 to December 2015, opened March 2016 3. Munich to Ocho Rios, June 2013 to December 2015, opened March 2016 Prime Minister, the Most Honorable Andrew Hallness, has renamed the North-South Highway as the Edward Sega Highway. Mr. Hallness, who officially renamed the highway during a ceremony at the Unity Valley Toll Plaza in Munig, St. Anne, on Tuesday, June 12, said the gesture is in honor of the former Prime Minister's contribution, his work, his dedication, his sacrifice, and his life.